Uh, so listen, it's a little bit toasty out there right now. <laughs> Already is. feeling over 100 degrees in many spots. Wow. And so it's only going to get warmer mm -hmm. today and especially tomorrow. So uh, tough stuff to deal with out there. Mm -hmm. So uh, plan accordingly for any outdoor plans this afternoon, this evening, even at nighttime. And the combination of uh, warm nights and high humidity is mm -hmm. going to make it quite draining on you as well. So here's the story at the moment. Uh, heat advisory now in effect until 8 o'clock tonight for everybody on the map that's uh, highlighted there including northern uh, Falkir County and for good reason it's going to feel at times over 105 degrees or at least close to it at most locations temperatures as of noon 92 do you think well that's you know we've been hotter than that yeah and we will get hotter than that this afternoon but the number you don't see on this map is the fact that the dew point temperature is 77 degrees right now that combination is beyond tropical I mean it's very uncomfortable it feels like it's 106 degrees right now Tough numbers. All right, so let's separate the air temperatures and feels like temperatures. On the thermometer, the air temperatures were forecasting to be in this order, about 97 at Reagan National, 96 at Dulles, 97 at BWI Thurgood Marshall. Here are the records for the date. So when you get this close, who knows, we could set or tie those records in many areas and then add several degrees on top of that for the way it feels. Here's a good example, too, from our Weatherbug Network. It's 93 right now in Beltsville. Feels like 104 degrees. Ashburn is 95, now up to 105 degrees. Feels Feels like 106 degrees in Ashburn, feels like 107 in Chevy Chase, feels like uh, 105 degrees at uh, Silverbrook Elementary School in Fairfax Station. Now, as far as the numbers go today, about 97, obviously very hot and humid, but it will feel between 100 and 105 degrees and at times higher than that. An occasional breeze, but it's going to be blowing hot, humid air all around the area. Our future cast shows a couple showers and thunderstorms popping this afternoon to the west. A huge area of high pressure extends from our area way out in the Atlantic Ocean. In the short term, like yesterday, it uh, pretty much blocked the, uh, east, the eastward movement of these showers and storms. But as we get through the afternoon, although most of them will stay in our northern and western viewing area, not out of the question, Montgomery Fairfax may see an isolated storm uh, even later tonight. Then we get through the day tomorrow, another day of blazing heat and humidity. No shower or storm activity in the morning, but again in the afternoon, we may see a couple start to pop up closer to the metro area. It is going to be a tough weekend with big numbers. Now, in advance of uh, this heat building even more tomorrow, Tomorrow, the National Weather Service has placed the entire I-95 corridor and beyond under an excessive heat watch. That is the next level above a heat advisory. And for the Delaware Valley area, they're under an excessive heat warning already. And parts of our area could be upgraded to a heat warning tomorrow. Our future heat index shows that as we get through Saturday, it's going to feel at times maybe to 110, 111 degrees. Larry, that is tough stuff. We'll cool off a little bit by the end of next week, but this is a, a rough heat wave and uh, just hunker down. We'll get through it. Yeah, just sometimes you, it, it's even hard to breathe. Yeah, when you go out there. It's literally it's, it's stifling. Yep. Yeah, okay. All right, Doug, okay. thanks. Well, the uh, heat will not keep the Montgomery County Fair from starting today. ABC 7 and News Channel 8 are proud TV sponsors. Eileen Whalen and Kittle Shea have more from Gaithersburg. Well, the Montgomery County Fair about to start at three o'clock. The gates open. Kid O'Shea, your first time at the fair. What do you think? I know. I absolutely love it. And this is the fair that you grew up going to. So here we are by all the rides. How's it look? It looks amazing. It looks like it does every year. I've been coming here since I was this big. So much fun. Not only tons of rides, but amazing food. They've got all of the animals. You can see the baby goats. You can see bunnies. You can see chickens. Uh, just a lot of of fun for for every yeah. family every age range and 10 bucks to get in kids 11 and under are free you can't ask for a better deal. Exactly. And since it is going to be so hot, they definitely have lots of places where you can go find some relief, some shade. They encourage you to bring some water. Uh, and of course, you yeah. know, drinking while eating some amazing Ooh. food. We have to talk to you about some of the food we have here. So we have funnel cakes. This is the one with powdered sugar. This is the glazed uh, funnel cake, which I had never had until I came here to the Montgomery mm -hmm. County Fair. What are these? Fried Oreos. Who doesn't love a fried Oreo? Have you ever had one before? No, and you had one earlier. How yeah. was it? it? I mean, anything fried, in my opinion, is pretty darn good. That's really good. Not too bad. Of course, the classic cotton, cotton candy. candy. And this. Tell me a little bit about Breakfast this. Breakfast on a stick. Breakfast sausage wrapped in bacon and then dipped in pancake batter and deep fried. Amazing. I thought it was a corn dog, so wow. something a little little different, but lots to do yeah. here. A little bit of everything for everybody. I love the fair. I love the fair, too, and I love cotton candy. We'll see you here at the Montgomery County Fair. <laughs> Having too much fun. Stay with us. More ABC 7 News at noon after this.
Get the cash you need when you need it. Cash to pay the unexpected when you least expect it. Title Max, cash is what you get. Visit TitleMax.com. Go on, find out how much you can get, whether it's one, five, or ten thousand dollars. At Title Max, all credit accepted, and it's as easy as one, two, three. One, a vehicle. Two, a title. Three, an ID. Title Max, it's easy, and you'll say, I got my title back with Title Max. I got my title back with Title Max. ABC 7 News is brought to you in part by Maryland Department of Health and Mental Hygiene. Did you know that Window World windows are backed by a lifetime warranty? Imagine a whole house of 10 Energy Star windows, 3190 installed, and great financing options, even 0%. Call to